Do you know the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man? Hello. Making muffins. I've already put the mix in the bowl, so now I need to add an egg. Crack. In it goes. Mix, 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 mix that egg. <laughs> and now a little bit of water. So the mixture all binds together. Stir it around. Mixing, mixing, mixing. La, 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 la. Hello. Ah, hello, hello Georgie. Andrew. Well, I've got the muffin tin and patty pans to put in the tin so that the mixture doesn't stick. There we go. <laughs> and another two. There we are. Right, this mixture's looking pretty good. These muffins are going to be fruity muffins. Oh, yum. Mm. And I've got some fresh blueberries here. Do you like blueberries? Oh, I love blueberries. Tip them in, stir yeah, them all yum. around. Mix and mix and mix and mix, <laughs> mix, mix, mix. That's looking good, isn't it? Yeah. All right. Uh, I think this mixture is ready to be put into the muffin tin. Right, well, the tin is ready and waiting. Right, you've got a spoon. For me, thank you. I've got a spoon. Let's put the muffin mix in. <gasps> Do you know the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man, the Muffin Man? Do you know the Muffin Man who lives in Drury Lane? Well, we're still going. Yes, I've got another one to go there. Okay. Might sing it again, I think. Yes, we know the Muffin Man. The yes, Muffin we know Man, the Muffin Man. Yes, we know the Muffin Man. He lives in Drury Lane. Is that oh, it? I think we did very well. I there we too. go. One last bit in there. There. Here we are. These muffins are ready to go in the oven. Mm. On with the oven gloves. Straighten that one up. There we are. Thank you, Georgie. There we are. Let's pop those on the tray. Muffins will be ready at the end of play school. Have you ever had a muffin? Maybe at home or in a cafe? Cafe. A play school cafe. Expecting lots of customers today, so just getting everything ready. Now, made some placemats for our customers. And here we have a caterpillar for Andrew with a long body and antennae and Andrew's name on it. So, a caterpillar placemat. And here we have a crocodile with a long body. Snap, snap, snappy jaws and little Ted's name on it. And here we have a big hippo for Big Ted with a big round body and Big Ted's name on it. Now I'm just finishing off Jemima's placemat. It's going to be a train. So there's the front of the train. There's the back of the train. I've got four little patty pans for the wheels. One, two, and three, four. And then we Jemima's train placemat. There we are. Toot, toot. Now, let's go and put them on the table, ready for our customers. Hey, okay. here we go. Now I've got the caterpillar first. Andrew's placemat. And Andrew can sit there. Then next, I've got little Ted, the crocodile, snap, snap, and big Ted's hippo. He can sit there next to Andrew and little Ted. Last of all, we have Jemima's train. Toot, toot. Mama can sit there. Okay, so Play School Cafe is open and ready for its customers. And the customers are nearly ready for the cafe. Just putting on their coats. Yeah, do up Big Ted's blue coat. He looks very smart. Now, little Ted, he can't decide between his brown coat or his checked coat. Hmm, what's that? Oh, little Ted says his brown coat matches his ears. So we'll put that one on, shall we? Through the hand goes, and the other side. Put the arm through, little Ted. Oh, 
He's got very nice wooden toggles at the front to do up. That one. And another toggle. There you are, little Ted. All set to go outside. Hm, very smart. Jemima. Well, Jemima just loves her favourite coat. It's the warm coat with the hot pink collar and the matching pockets. Round we go. Arm this way, please, Jemima. Push it through. Peekaboo, I can see your fingers. There. Now, do up the top button. That's nice and cosy, isn't it? There. Toys are all ready to go to the cafe. <gasps> Let's go to the cafe. It's nearly time for brunch. Too late for breakfast. It's too early for lunch. So shake it, baby, shake it. Shake it if you can. Shake it like a milkshake and drink it if you can. Oh, rumble to the bottom and rumble to the top and round and round and round and round and round until you stop. Let's rumble and sh shake it again, shall we? <gasps> Let's go to the cafe. It's nearly time for brunch. It's too late for breakfast, too early for lunch. So shake it, baby, shake it. Shake it if you can. Shake it like a milkshake and drink it if you can. So rumble to the bottom and rumble to the top. And round and round and round and round and round until you stop. Ah, I've worked up quite an appetite. Come on, toys. Let's go to the cafe. I wonder what kind of food they'll have. Hmm? Welcome to the cafe. We're open now, you see. Lots of things to eat and drink for breakfast, lunch and tea. Oh, excuse me, waitress. Yes? Would you um, happen to have a table for four, by any chance? Well, you're just in luck, sir. We happen to have one table and it seats four. Excellent. Right this way. Thank you. Oh, yeah. wow, how thoughtful well, place, Matt. Yes, now, Big Ted is over here and he's got the hippo. There we go. Pink hippo and, mm. oh, here's little Ted. You hold your mama. Thank you. And I'll put little Ted down here. He's got the crocodile placement. <laughs> there you are, little Ted. And here's Jemima with the train. Oh, and look, I've got the caterpillar. Now, what would you like to order? Here are today's specials. Oh, lots to choose from. Um, let's see. Oh, muffin. Big Ted loves muffins. Mm -hmm. So he would like a muffin and a milkshake, please. Muffin and a milkshake for Big Ted. Um... Yes. Don't you need to write this down? How oh. will you remember all our orders? I have a very good memory, sir. Now, what about oh. the little bear? Little Ted? Oh, well, little Ted's feeling very healthy today, mm. so he would like... Uh, he'd like a salad. Mm -hmm. And a juice, please. Salad and a juice for little Ted. Um, oh, now, Jemima... Well, Jemima loves... Um, ah, toasted focaccia oh. and her favourite latte. Right, OK, I'll get a toasted focaccia. And what about a cappuccino for, for Jemima? Um, what's that, Jemima? Yes, yeah, she's changed her mind. She'll right. have a cappuccino. OK, focaccia and a cappuccino for Jemima. But you know what? I like latte, so I will have a latte. And I... I'm feeling very hungry, so I think I'll have a hamburger, please. <gasps> hamburger and a latte for the gentleman. Now, are you sure you don't need to write all this down? Oh, sir, I have a very good memory. I'm a... I'm a waitress. Oh. Trust me. I'll be right back. Um, oh, excuse me. Sorry, waitress, but um, <laughs> actually I've changed my mind. Um, instead of the, the latte, yes. I'll have a double uh, skim flat cappuccino with two sugars. Um, oh, and in a glass, please. Coming right up, sir. In a glass. I think I got that right. <sighs> She's a very efficient waitress, isn't she? Have you ever been in a cafe? It's a very good place to be when you're feeling hungry, like me. I'm so hungry. I'm hungry. I'm very, very hungry. I'm so hungry. So hungry. I'm very, very hungry. I want something I can munch. Mm, or something I can crunch. I haven't had my lunch. And I'm hungry. I'm so 
hungry. I'm hungry. I'm very, very hungry. I'm hungry. Oh, just in time then. Oh. Okay, Looks now good. we have a milkshake and a muffin for Jemima. Yeah. Uh, no, sorry, I don't think Jemima ordered that. Um, I think Big Ted ordered the muffin, yes? Right. And the milkshake. Oh, right, sorry. It's been very busy today. Yeah. Right, so Jemima ordered the juice yeah. and a salad. Um, <laughs> sorry, I don't think so. Um, I think that was little Ted's order. There you are. Juice and salad, little Ted. What was I thinking? OK, then Jemima ordered a hamburger. Now, let me see if I can get this right. A double weak decaf skim flat white with two sugars. Uh, sorry, but um, I ordered the hamburger and um, I think that one is mine too. Right, OK, I I'm sorry. So I was just testing your memory. Oh, right, right, we have the toasted focaccia and a cappuccino for Jemima. That's right. Well, enjoy your meals. Thank you very much. Pleasure. <laughs> well, I don't think I was a very good waitress. <laughs> oh, yes, you were. Georgie did a very good job remembering all oh. those types of food, didn't well, she? It's very tricky trying to remember things, isn't it? There's somebody in the story who has to remember things. But what do we do before the story? We look at the clock. What's the time on the train clock? Well, the big hand is pointing straight up, so it's something o'clock. The little hand is pointing to the six, so it's six o'clock on the train clock. Here comes the train, out of the tunnel, round the corner and pulling up at the station. And on the back of the train, a cake shop. A boy goes shopping in the story today. There he is. And there's his shopping basket. And the story is called Don't Forget the Bacon. And it goes like this. Six farm eggs, a cake for tea, a pound of pears, and don't forget the bacon. Mum's given him a lot of shopping to remember. Six fat legs, a cake for tea, a pound of pears, and don't forget the bacon. Mm. Six fat legs, a cape for me, a pound of pears, and don't forget the bacon. <laughs> Do you think he's getting a little bit muddled up? <laughs> Six fat legs, a cape for me, uh, a flight of stairs, and don't forget the bacon. Six clothes pegs, a cape for me, a flight of stairs, and don't forget the bacon. Oh, now he's really muddled up. <laughs> Six clothes pegs. <gasps> A rake for leaves, a flight of stairs, and don't forget the bacon. Six clothes pegs, a rake for leaves, a pile of chairs, and don't forget the bacon. Six clothes pegs, a rake for leaves, and a pile of chairs, please. Uh oh. <laughs> That doesn't sound right. A pile of chairs, uh, a flight of stairs, uh, a pound of pears. Ah, he's remembered one of the things. A rake for leaves, a cape for me, uh, a cake. For tea. <laughs> He's remembered another thing. Six clothes pegs, six fat legs, six farm eggs. <laughs> six farm eggs, a cake for tea, and a pound of pears. 
the boy has remembered everything. Or has he? Ah! <gasps> I forgot the bacon. <laughs> dear, dear, dear. Ah, oh, there he is, heading back to the shops to get the bacon. <laughs> and that's the end of the story. I'm heading to the shops too. I'm running to the shops. Come on, you run too. Ready? I'm running to the shops. I'm running very fast. I'm running to the shops. I'm getting there at last. I'm puff, 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 puffing. I'm puffing a lot. I'm hot, hot, hot. Oh. Well, I've done the shopping. Now let's run to the bus stop. Come on, you come with me. Ready? Run, 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 run. I'm running to the bus stop. I'm running very fast. I'm running to the bus stop. I'm getting there at last. I'm puff, 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 puffing. I'm puffing a lot. I'm hot, hot, hot. <sighs> well, we've made it to the bus stop. And here's the bus, brum, brum, with the name of the day. And today is Thursday. It's Thursday on the bus calendar. Now, this bus is going somewhere very special today. It's going to the train station. And there's another train station over there. A station with a steam train ready to leave. A model railway with lots and lots of tracks. There's buildings, even a church right up here on the hill and lots of tunnels that go through the mountains. To make this train go, you need a control. If I turn the knob this way, the train will go forward. If I turn it the other way, the train goes backwards. Lots of carriages on this train. These front carriages are for passengers. You might look through the window and see people sitting in there when they get on board. And coming along behind are the freight cars. They carry heavy things, goods and parcels that need to be delivered. Oh, I think the train's ready to leave. All aboard! Train on platform one is about to leave. All aboard, please! Better use the control knob. Everybody's on board, so the train is ready to leave. Pulling out of the station. Wheels go round, chuffing along, getting up speed so it can go through the tunnel and all the way through the steep hills. <laughs> Out through the other side, it's pulling up the hill. Chuff, 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 chuff. Going through the mountain, coming out through this tunnel. Right across the tall bridge, round the bend it goes. <laughs> Hello, cows. Those cows like watching the train as it goes past while they're munching on their grass. Over the railway bridge at the back. It's going to come down here, ready to pull into the station again, slowing down. <laughs> so all the passengers can get off and new passengers can get on board for the next journey. <laughs> Another train waiting at the station. Come on, you be a train too. Down at the station early in the morning See the little puffer trains all in a row See the engine driver pull the little handle Woo, woo, choo, choo, off we go Another train Train is a coming, oh yeah Train is a coming Train is a coming, oh yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wow, there's a great big hill up ahead. How big? Really big. The little red engine was chuffing along when he came to a great big hill. He said, I must chuff and never stop. I must chuff, chuff, chuff till I get to the top. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. And he chuffed right over the hill. Oh. 
trains have chuffed right back to the station. We're going to see another train waiting at the station through the windows. Mm, I wonder which window it will be. Goodbye square window. See you later diamond window. It's not the round window. So that means it's the arched window today. And through we go. My papa's going on a long train trip. My name's Shakira. And my mum and I are taking Papa to the train. Hello, how are you? Good, thank you. Um, you're in this carriage, in room number five and six. Thank you very much. Yeah. Mum and I are going to see Papa's cabin. This is five and six, Papa. This is your room. Good. OK, let's go and look at it. Oh, this looks comfortable for a long trip. Oh, I guess where the bed is, Shakira. What's this here? How's that? How's that? And the bed's all made up. Want to see where the bathroom is? Let's have a look in here. The hand basin. Come down like that. There's the toilet. Comes down like that. And when I want to have a shower, I've got to put everything up like that and stand here, turn the taps on and have a shower. How's that? That's cool. Time for us to say goodbye. See you guys. Bye. Bye, Bye darling. Bye, Bye baby. Good luck. Have Bye. a good trip. We love you. Okay. Bye-bye. All aboard. The conductor gets on the train and the doors are closed. The train is ready to leave. The train moves very slowly at first. So many carriages. Have a good trip. Have you ever waved somebody off on a trip? At the station? Or at the airport? So long. Farewell. Auf Wiedersehen. All different ways of saying goodbye. So, so long. Farewell. Auf Wiedersehen. Goodbye. I leave and heave a sigh and say goodbye. Goodbye. Adios. Auf Wiedersehen. <laughs> So long, farewell, our feet is in adieu, 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 to you and you and you. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Well, it's nearly time for us to say goodbye from play school today. But I remember the muffins. Oh, look how much they've risen and they, they smell delicious. Maybe you'd like to help somebody cook something. Or wave goodbye to a friend. <laughs> goodbye. See you later on Play School. Bye. Bye.